Hi y'all, I wanted to do the contents and review for you of this beautiful um, Nerea Balenciaga pom pom bag. So if you saw the previous video on my channel where I did a reveal of this, my friend has been kind enough to let me borrow this for a while. It's a discontinued style, but a style I've always been interested in. Um, then not being a lot of places in Brisbane to try on Balenciaga bags, I never had a chance before, but she's kindly lent me the this one. Um, so I'll show you what fits inside. It's a really big bag. It sags down nicely but you can see it's very large. Um, so it fits obviously a lot more than I'd usually carry. So I can put the wallet inside, put my keys in the back pocket there, put my phone in the front pocket, my coach um, work pouch, keys and pass and everything, um, my little Louis Vuitton pochette, hand cream, um, sunglasses case. I can also easily fit a bottle of water in here. So I've just kind of sort of thrown everything in there. That's what it looks like inside. As you can see, there's still plenty of space. It's a huge, big cavern of a bag. Because it's got the pompon has this rounded base. So everything kind of sort of fills in in any which way. There's no real organization to it where uh, something like a city bag has got a little bit more of a structure. This is just a big, big, beautiful cavern of <laughs> bag. So the other things that I can easily put in here are something like a notebook that fits in really nicely um, if you like me have a cold office you might have like an extra cardigan or a scarf in your bag but as you can see it's still not even full yet I still got plenty of space to add more things in the only reason I wouldn't add more in and the only reason I probably wouldn't fill the bag up that much is that it gets really heavy <laughs> because you're carrying a lot of things so don't let the size fool you. You can hold a lot and it can fit a lot. It's perfect if you carry a lot of things, but if you're carrying a lot of heavy things like bottles of water, um, wallets, um, if you have a lot of like keys or something in your bag, it does get very, very heavy. Um, the other thing to note is that when it's stuffed full like this, it changes the way that it hangs when it's worn. So I'll show you what I mean by that and some of the different ways that you can wear it. And the Balenciaga pom-pom is stuffed full. This is what it looks like. Um, it is very heavy because it has absolutely everything inside. Um, but the weight is distributed well with these straps. So you can carry it handheld or over your shoulder. You can also tie the drawstring to pull in the shape of the bag a little bit more and again it still fits over your shoulder nicely. So with the long strap when you've got the drawstring it goes over this way if you just want to, if you're tall enough to use the long strap but for me I have to use the long strap crossbody. Now you can see that it is quite a bulky bag when it's worn this way. Again it's stuffed full with literally everything. Um, and I am petite, so it, it does kind of overwhelm me a little bit. Pulling the drawstring in helps a bit. Um, one thing to note is if you don't pull the drawstring too tight, you can still reach in and grab things. When it's one-handed operation, it's very easy to see inside, grab what you need. Rummage around a little bit because it does have that circular base. So you do rummage around a little bit, but you can easily with one hand find what you need. Although you do need two hands to pull the drawstring tight again. Um, it is a really nice bag, but when it is full, it does look a bit bulky on me. Um, I think when it would be stuffed full, my preferred way to carry it would be the straps. It kind of helps it sag down a little bit more and doesn't look as overwhelming on my frame. This is an absolutely beautiful bag. I love the colour. The shape is so unique. It's not like anything else I have in my bag collection. I like that you can change the way the bag looks just by pulling the drawstring tighter. Um, it gives it a different shape. It looks different when it's worn. You can 
use the handles, you can use this big long strap. Um, and like all Balenciagas, it's super light, even with um, the extra metal around the, um, the tie that holds it all in place, the drawstring. It's still a really light bag. It is easy due to its large size because this is the regular pompon. Um, it's so easy to overstuff it because everything fits inside. <laughs> so you could still add more to here and the temptation would be to do that until you pick it up and you realize that it does get really heavy. Um, if you do like carrying a lot around and obviously you're used to carrying that kind of weight around with you, then this is the perfect bag for you. It is such a stunning bag. I like how easy it is to wear different ways. Um, it's easy to get in and out of. It's one-handed when it's on to reach inside and grab stuff. If you are considering getting it, I'd say go for it with the caveat that if you do fill it up to the brim, it is going to be heavy. Um, but if you want a big bag that carries everything and still looks good, this is a, a key contender. Um, it is discontinued, but you can find it on some resale sites. Um, I don't know if you have any luck finding it in this gorgeous purple color. I don't think anyone would want to part with this, it's such a nice shade. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed my little review for you. If you have any comments or questions, just leave them down below. And thank you very much for watching.